Good morning. It is Wednesday, May 29th, 2024. Back here for Daily Shakeup number 899. Yes, 899. And today I want to talk about timing. And in particular, this trap we fall into on a regular basis that says we're waiting for the right time, for a better time. Whether it's for big things or little things, whether it's making a job change or a career change, maybe it's making a move of where you live, maybe it's a change in a relationship, maybe it's just a conversation you've been avoiding, maybe it's a trip, some grand adventure or small trip, maybe it's just a phone call that you keep putting off. I need to have the right time, the perfect time. And it's just a form of procrastination because the reality is for virtually anything we're contemplating, there's never truly going to be a right time other than right now. Now, I'm not saying that you do everything all at once today, but wouldn't that be better off if we were leaning towards do it now? Martin Luther King said, the time is always right to do what is right. Similarly, a thought came to me many years ago when I was making a decision about leaving a, what I considered to be a secure job to go out on my own again after some challenging business um, results. But well, I was challenged so many times by people saying, I can't believe this is when you chose to do it. The economy was terrible. There were all sorts of reasons not to do it then. And what I said to them was, well, I guess I figure that it's always the right time for the right thing. It's always the right time for the right thing. And we don't always get to know the outcome as it's actually going to turn out right. See, that's the risk in it. That's the vulnerability. That's where that's where courage comes in, is stepping forward, even though we sense it's the right time. We don't know if it's the right time. And maybe it's the right time, even if we don't get the results we want. Think about that. It's the right time, even if we didn't get the results. And think about how much you carry the burden or the weight or just the distraction of thought when you're holding off on something. So whatever it is, take a step forward, do it now. Even if it's not the full step or the full process, take a step towards it. If you're look, if you're thinking about traveling internationally and you don't have your passport, get your passport. So many people say, I'll get my passport when I schedule the trip. No, that's not how it works. You're more likely to schedule the trip when you get your passport. If you're hesitating about taking vacation, put it on your calendar, block it off for work, claim it, and then build around it. If it's the phone call, pick up the phone. If it's some decision about business or life, make a decision or make a list of what you need to do in order to make a decision, not think about it. Because thinking about it doesn't count. There's a place for thinking, but thinking is a brief period in time when we decide to do or not do. The rest is procrastination, paralysis analysis. So think about this, walk through life with this. It's always the right time for the right thing. Not necessarily the outcome. We don't control outcomes, but we choose and control the out the steps and actions we take and the intentions we have and the mindsets we walk forward in every part of our life. That's what leadership's about. It's the right time. Do it now.